Local students taking on a new challenge at school and are participating in activities that encourage being kind to one another. Tiffany Huertas joins us from Woodlawn Hills Elementary School with how the Kindness Challenge is creating a culture of kindness and helping students in different ways. Good morning. Good morning, Mark and Stephanie. Happy Friday. What an incredible project, right? These students are having lots of fun this morning and they're participating in different activities. Right now, these are repurposed toys for animals. We have music teacher Irina Duran with us this morning to talk more about these challenges. Good morning. Tell us more about them. Hi, good morning. This is a group of um, our choir students and patrols uh, and rondaya students. We have um, our um, students repurposing. We're an IB campus, and so we talk a lot about how we can um, better our world through through um, our um, different activities. And so this one, um, they're using old t-shirts and braiding them into dog toys and some old water bottles and uh, making them chew toys. What other activities are students participating in? Around campus, we do have um, a... a rock painting with a lot of positive affirmations. We made a mural where students can go and um, take pictures, be the eye in kind, because we've talked about how um, it starts with us and being able to pass that on forward. We've also um, done a video um, where we included students and staff and um, been able to, to pay it forward in different types of projects. We have um, kindness uh, buddy benches where students can get together and um, sit and talk with each other, teachers and students alike. And the school can also benefit from these challenges. Yes, we are um, being able to apply for a grant with all of these um, different activities. And um, with that, it's hopefully something that we can continue, not just for the monetary um, value of that, but also um, something that the kids can, can learn from and take with them. Because you said that they're learning different things along the way. Yes, we've, as an IB campus, we try to instill that we are um, compassionate and we have um, a lot of... Um, Self, uh, self reflective, uh, being communicators, knowledgeable, um, caring, and risk takers. And so we're hoping to, to pass that forward. Awesome. And this morning we also have fifth grade student Anastasia with us. Good morning, Anastasia. I'm coming for you. Yeah. Tell me about your favorite part of participating in this challenge. Uh, I like how it like makes you feel good and that we get to give back to the community. And it's a lot of fun? Yeah. Awesome. You see, that's what it's all about. It's about having fun on this Friday. We're going to have more details on this project coming up on The Noon Show. We'll send it back to you. Hello, everybody. Stefania Jimenez here. Thank you so much for watching KSAT's YouTube channel. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.